Before we get started, if you're also a Reading Eggs customer, you'll need to complete your Reading Eggs rollover before you can complete this MathSeeds rollover. Check out the video to show you how. OK, to get started, you'll need 1. The names and unique email addresses of any new teachers and 2. Your student list with their allocated classes for the new school year. Once you get started, your teachers will be locked out of class management until rollover is complete. Ready? OK, let's go. To start, log in to your MathSeeds admin account. Now navigate to Management and then Manage Rollover. Now click Start Rollover. We're first going to update our teacher and student lists for the new school year. If you have any new teachers, add them by clicking Go to Manage Teachers so they're in the system and ready for export. Don't worry, you'll be able to delete teachers later if need be. Click Continue Rollover and then click Next. Now let's update your student list for the new academic year. Export a student list and open the file. It will download as a CSV file. Be sure not to delete or edit the header row, as it's required for successful upload. Select all, then sort by year to organise the students into year level. Remove the students who've left the school. Remember this might be all of year 6. Adjust the grade level for all students by increasing it by 1. For example, kindergarten or reception students will move to year 1. Add your new kindergarten or reception students and any other students who are new to the school. Your new students won't have a student ID yet, but don't worry, we'll get there. Add the teacher email address for each class in column E. These email addresses determine the classes, so make sure the email address is unique to the teacher. OK, now that we have an up-to-date student list with their corresponding teacher, Let's continue rollover. Back in our rollover, click Upload CSV. Check the pre-import summary, and if it's looking good, simply click Complete Import. If the import was successful, you'll see this pop-up, and we can move to the next step by clicking Next. OK, now that we have an up-to-date student list with their corresponding teacher, let's continue rollover. Next, you'll see a list of all the classes from the previous academic year. If you're performing this rollover to start the new academic year, you'll need to delete all of these to make way for this year's classes. Simply select all and delete classes, and then click Next. The next step is to check and delete any unallocated students. When you've finished, click Continue Rollover. Back on the rollover screen, click Next. Then complete rollover and you're done. Now all of your MathSeed students are in their correct year group and classes so teachers are ready to start the academic year.